How can we help small business owners thrive? Today we welcome Barbara Corcoran, star of Shark Tank, an entrepreneur and business expert, and more on an upcoming contest. Everybody loves you here in Charleston. Barbara, how are you today? Yeah, I'm very fine, Tom. Nice to be with you. I love your city, but who doesn't? Uh, that's true. Very true. Tell us about this contest to help small business owners. This is a contest directed at anyone who owns a small business and wants to see it grow big. It's a contest sponsored by On Deck, which of course is the leader in on de pardon me, the leader in online lending to all small business. All you have to do is go on their Facebook page, On Deck Facebook page, and apply and you can win $10,000. We're gonna have three winners, not just one, because we want to make a lot of people happy. And you'll also get national exposure and an in-person visit with me to help me help you grow your business. Oh, I tell you what, and with you backing that individual, it can't be anything but just a total success, right? Well, I would say that's a gross exaggeration. No, that wouldn't be exactly the case. You really need a great entrepreneur to drive the business. And so I'm hoping the people win these contests have that God-given talent. And you know, I read that about 90% of the employees work actually for small businesses here in the United States. So why is it so important to buy local and support small business efforts? Well, well, you kind of just said why it's so important, Tom. If, if the small business community is creating 90% of the job market, you want to put your money, your spending power behind those small businesses. And so the most important individual in my book in America is a small business owner, and yet they're also the same person who struggles the hardest with developing a business because they usually have cash flow constraints, can't hire who they need, can't grow the business, can't meet the additional rent roll, whatever. And it's just not easy. So any support you could lend to them in, their, in your local town, I mean, I feel like it's a charity act uh, as well as a, a prudent act to support your country. Mm -hmm. And you know, a lot of times people have such a great idea. They, they bring that a lot of times to Shark Tank, but a lot of people have great ideas. They just don't know how to get it off the ground. How can business owners build their brand and market to new customers? I think getting the business off the ground is frankly the easiest part because people fall in love with their idea. I think a lot of people fall in love with an idea and don't ask, say, their mother-in-law versus their husband or wife, hey, you think this is a good idea? The mother-in-law will always tell you the truth. A lot of people <laughs> get a business right off the ground and they don't really ask, are people willing to pay for my product or service at a price that would make this business viable? And so, again, a lot of people come off the ground with the business with wild enthusiasm, but they often uh, are not able to make a go of it. I think even if you have a good business idea, and if you're an entrepreneur that knows how to hustle and confront a lot of rejection, you'll get along the way. You still have to be the kind of individual that could get over objections right through the entire building process and keep coming back to take another hit and keep coming back and getting over the next obstacle. And so it's not so easy, but the easiest part, contrary to what you think, uh, Tom, from my experience, is getting it off the ground. It's just getting it going once it's off the ground and building the business. That's where the hard work begins. And not running out of gas, that's for sure. Keep it going and keep driving and yeah, continue yeah, yeah. to believe in what you've got. How can people uh, enter in on this contest, Barbara? It's so easy. You just go on, on Deck's Facebook page and enter. It just takes a few minutes. You just tell us how you're going to use the money to build your business, and you might be one of the three lucky winners with that $10,000 prize. Barbara Corkin, thank you so much for joining us today from New York City. Have a great My and safe pleasure, holiday. My pleasure, Tom. Yes, ma'am. Have a great and uh, safe thank holiday Thank you very season. much. Okay. And we've got more Low Country Live coming up in just a moment.